welcome to my channel and if you're new to my channel welcome to you guys what can you see you can see bigger dice this week okay i quite enjoyed um the numerology and the dice concept um last week but i have brought my poetry words back in and i've done them sort of randomly um so it's sort of a lucky dick poetry this week i've just folded up the little um poetry words and put them in this little box and we will pull them out individually lucky dips um to go with the readings so a bit of a tombola tarot this week guys so with that said and done let's get into the readings now going to be reading for the lovely star sign of aquarius so aquarius let's get your poetic words out to start with there's not many left in here now but uh, we'll have a little shuffle around just move these out the way so what have we got spirits oh that one <laughs> thank you so Aquarius, your poetic words for this week then, what have we got on here? Stargazing, a shooting star will be a wish come true. A man wearing a snazzy suit and blue tie will be important to some of you. A gift of a purse or wallet is a sign they want to be more than friends and a celebration can be had this week when some study comes to an end. So. I feel some of you may have been sort of stargazing um, and, and seen shooting stars, okay? And it's saying a wish is going to be coming true. I feel this is a shooting star that you may have seen um, sort of six, seven weeks ago where you would have seen it and made a wish and it's just to say that this wish is being manifested. Um, I feel it's got something to do with this man wearing a snazzy suit and a blue tie um, connection that... Maybe some of you have wished um, for a change of job, okay? Or maybe going into some kind of study. But there's something about a man in a suit and a blue tie. So just to be mindful of that, okay? I feel a gift or a purse of a, uh, a gift of a purse or a wallet from somebody um, is a sign they like you more than just friends. So, again, that's not going to resonate with everybody, but if you get gifted um, a purse or a wallet from somebody, just know I feel there's more to it than meets the eye. And there's a celebration this week when some study comes to an end. I feel some of you are going to get some information, if it's not you directly, somebody around you gets good marks um, from some exams that they've taken. So, with that said and done, let's start throwing the dice, shall we? So let's just shake this and see what we get for the first part of this reading. We've got number three for you. So before I go into there, I'll just do your numerology numbers. And we have 26. Now 26 can be a significant door number uh, this week. 26 can also be uh, a number that you may see around um, on certain things as well to look out for and if you do see 26 anywhere this week check it out on um, on Google because numbers are associated to angel messages as well so 26 could be an angel message for you if you break this down to um, 2 and 6 together it comes to an 8 8 is going to be significant for your synchronicities of um, 8 okay 88 um that you again may see this week so again if you do see the number i want to say 88 though not just eight i want to say 88 for you uh, again it is a message from your guides and angels and you can look up the interpretations for that number the 26 going back to that i want to say the 26th of october is going to be an important day it can be um, a memory link of somebody in spirit as well so with that said and done let's get number three out of here and see what's coming out for you this week Aquarius so we have some nudity on these cards so I can only apologize for that but we've got intent coming out as your overall energy this week and it says focus your energy there is amazing power in a strong intention okay focus your energy 
there is amazing power in a strong intention so i look at this card though as i said in my poetic words i feel like a wish is coming true something that you have been focusing on something that you've been manifesting i feel is going to be coming out for you this week aquarius let's just have a look at the clarifier with it and it's the page of cups the environment that you are in at the moment you don't feel comfortable in around a certain situation because i look at the fish in inside the teacup here and that's not would, would not be his normal environment so for some aquarians this week you're going to find yourself a bit like this fish out of water scenario but i also feel the page of cups card is about listening there's something that you need to pay attention to. There's something that is being overlooked by you or someone is overlooking a situation around you. So there's something that needs your attention this week, Aquarius. Your hidden spirit and psyche is feeling that justice, justice is needed on a situation. There's something that you're not happy with, okay? There's something that you are putting your whole focus in of late in order to change a situation, in order to change an environment that you feel uncomfortable with and it's as though you're trying to get justice for it. It could be somebody around you, okay, where you're trying um, and there's an intention here to get justice on a situation that does not sit right with you or sits right with somebody around you. It's very deep, Aquarius. The universe wants to bring in the here and now. Okay? So they're probably saying to you, there's things that you are keep mulling over a situation, which we have to do sometimes when we're trying to get problems solved. They're saying concentrate on the here and now. It could be a situation where you are worrying about the consequences of how you act on this situation. But Spirit is, is just saying here, coming from the universe, it's saying concentrate on what's needed now. It can also be an energy to bring you back to the now in order of this situation that you're, you're overlooking. So I like to say, come on here, Aquarius, there's something that needs your attention that is quite fragile because I look at the egg in this card so there's something that you are overlooking there's something that you are sitting on that you cannot see that needs urgently addressing because I look at the red in this card as well okay as I say it's very cryptic let's just get your animal spirit cards I feel it could be to do with um, a person around you in your family that you're unaware of who's who feels quite fragile at the moment who's dealing with issues that they're holding within and this is something that you may have to sort of address and get to find and get to the bottom of something so your animal spirit cards we have the alchemical sign of fire the lizard and the fire element again with the tiger The lizard is, I feel, the situation that you have got to change. I feel like when I look at the lizard, I feel like I associate that card with a chameleon and a chameleon adapts to its surroundings. And this is what it's saying. There's a situation around you, Aquarius, that needs to be changed. Okay? And you've got to be sort of um, brave and assertive and face your fears on this okay I also want to say a new chapter is about to start you're going to turn over a new leaf here you're going to it's going to sort of the penny's going to drop on whatever this situation is and you will um, be able to change it but you have to face your fears head on 
because it could be quite a daunting thing that you've got to deal with especially when justice needs to be found i mean when we're trying to prove something okay it is hard work but it's saying be fit you know be fearless like the, the tiger here and just keep going with it okay till you get your resolve your resolution your change whatever that may be that you are dealing with so let's just shake the dice for your spiritual messages to go with this and we've got number two and we have the first spiritual message we have is soul solitude your soul needs attention there are moments when it's important to get away not just from the noise of the outside world but to find a place where your soul can experience peace and quiet a place for soul solitude this is time to pause a time to reflect a time for you but it's highlighting the fact that as i said there's something being overlooked here by you aquarius or it's something that you are trying to get justice of at the moment but it's also saying to pay attention to yourself you could be feeling off it yourself at this moment in time but i do feel it's more of a case of somebody around you is hiding holding back and not being honest with some truth of what's going on at the moment in their life they're painting it sort of all happy and what have you but underneath it's breaking down they're breaking down mentally and physically because of some stress that obviously you are going to i feel if not already being pulled into having to sort the other spiritual card that comes out is vengeance can only hurt you let the universe and god deal with this situation there's something going to get you angry if this is a premonition okay a prediction that hasn't happened yet and this is where the justice may come in where you feel a family member or a, or a partner or a friend or what have you has had some injustices done or served upon them but it's like to say let karma deal with it there's only so much that we can deal with but it's like to say the universe will um, step in and do its bit, okay? As in what will be will be, what the outcome will be. Don't let this person, if it's not you, stress yourself over it too much. And then the fairy realms comes out with lost and found. What was once lost is about to be found. Thanks to the lost and found fairy, sometimes she can help us find things we never even realize we lost but the lost and found here i feel is the justice okay on this situation that is going to be presenting itself to you if you're not already dealing with this issue at this moment in time so the overall message on this aquarius for you this week is something needs to and something needs your attention if on a situation around you if it's a, a family member as i said there's something that it's been overlooked here so all i want to say is just keep your eyes and ears open where you may have your suspicions that somebody is holding something back and um they're going through it at the moment and once you do know what is going on then you will want the justice and get what's right for this person okay so let's just get one more card out and we have enlightenment okay so there'll be a situation that comes to light this week where there is others there waiting to help and assist i always look at this sometimes as um news of a pregnancy that wasn't planned so you may hear of somebody has got pregnant and this could be what's been hidden as well again that's not going to resonate for all of you but enlightenment as well it's just a change something's being reborn something's being changed but there's something that you have got to deal with and get justice on 
So my lovely Aquarians, it's very cryptic and very deep, but I hope some of you can take something from that message this week. Don't forget to check out your moon and rising signs. And until next time, you take care. Bye then.